episode of Tech Tips. We're going to look at how to build a table in Dreamweaver. We're going to do this by clicking in the common tab or you can go to insert to table. We're just going to go ahead and click in here. When we click in we're going to get a dialog box. It's going to ask us uh, how many rows, how many columns, our table width, our border thickness, cell padding, cell spacing. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to choose three rows and three columns. I'm going to change this from 800 percent to 800 pixels. And right now I'm not going to give any kind of border or cell padding or cell spacing. I'm going to go ahead and click on the OK button and now I see I have created my table with three rows and three columns. I'm going to deselect and you'll notice that it's not highlighted anymore and down here in my properties panel down here at the bottom I don't see the information for the table. So I'm going to change a couple things about the table. First I'm going to change the alignment and then some of the color space inside of the table. So what I want to do is just want to highlight that table and I'm going to now see in my properties panel where I have information on my table. Here I can go down here and change this. I'm going to change this now from 800 pixels I decided I really want to go with 900 pixels. Once we put that information in there we need to hit the return button for it to be active. Now I'm going to go over here to align and I'm going to choose center align. So you'll notice now that the table has center aligned. Now what I want to do is I want to kind of break this up for my design in Dreamweaver of my website. So I'm going to select these top three table air cells and I'm going to go down here in my properties panel and choose merge. Merge selected right here. So what that did is that merged all those cells together. Now I'm going to come over here to the left and I'm going to make this my menu area and I'm going to merge that cell as well. Now with these cells here I want to merge them together. And then I'm going to move this cell to the left. And I'm going to move my whole table down. I'm going to move this one up because this is going to be for my header image. So what I want to do here is I'm going to give this a background color. I'm going to give it a gray. Over here I'm going to give this a background color. A little bit, uh, let's go with a blue. I'm going to leave this inside white because that's where I'm going to have my text and information. Over here I'm going to have my menu bar. And over here I'm going to have my header image. Now you'll notice that the cursor is blinking halfway in the cell here. I'm going to change that by going to vertical default and click top. Um, that can affect the way that some of your information comes up in your table. But this is basically how you create a table, merge cells, and it, it begins to develop the basic structure of your web page. Good luck and have fun practicing building tables in Dreamweaver.